down through the years that I feel <laughs> that I have been a good father, raising my kids and everything. Um, I ain't going to say I've been the best of a father, but I'm going to say I've been one of oh, the best. Yes. All right. All right. And I think I treated my kids uh, very well. I tried to uh, make sure they have stuff that I didn't have when I was coming up. Uh, I probably can say I've been too nice to them. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the reason they like the ears, but they still all right. It's still here. It's still living. That's right. a blessing. That's man. right. All by itself. All by itself. Oh. And uh, I just want to tell you, you know, you got kids and stuff. Try to do the best you can for them and stuff. Do it while they yet live. Yeah. And so that's that's what I be doing. A lot of time, you know, like I ask that mind and you know, I get fed up with them and stuff. And I say, well, I'm through with y'all. I'm through with y'all. have nothing there. So on some songs, oh, y'all need to learn how to tote your own weight. I try to teach them about toting weight when they were smaller kids. Mm -hmm. And uh, I still talk the same stuff today. But yet, you still, you know, in some kind of way, you still have to find yourself helping them a little bit and stuff. And, you know, so I guess that's the way it goes. So I don't feel guilty about uh, being a father, the father, the kind of father that I've been toward my kids because I know I have did a good job. Yeah, so no matter what happened or, or whatever, I still feel good about it. I don't, I don't have to feel guilty about, well, I wasn't uh, there for my kids and all that. I got plenty of food, plenty of clothes, mm -hmm. probably a little too much of everything. <laughs> I thank the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen.